have. Hey, Rose, thank you for the 100 bits. Alright. So, plans that I have for us to test out stuff. Yes. Have fun in your life. Thank you for stopping by. Don't know why I wave when I don't have the camera on. Hi. Nah. I have been assaulted. <laughs> Finley placed his hand on my face. Hmm. Aggressively? Kinda. Alright, so. First thing I spotted while looking around. Hey, Ninja! How you doing tonight, bro? Alright, so. Got a long walk. Because <laughs> the first thing I spotted was a key. But it is a bit of a distance. Yeah, boy. And it's not like the gates are close by. To that one, at least. Yeah. But, hey. We, we know we're at the end 
pretty much the end game. We're just trying to get into the official end game. Oh, hey, more Death Knights. Ooh. Fight. All right. Death Knight spells. Yeah. Death Knight Bane. All right. He was the only one in my range that I could see. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> The only reason I say that is because, well, next up is Wolgraf and Bear Daughter, and the spell has a specific range, so. Yeah. Oh! But if you have That's action. That's weird. What's up? Apparently, I cannot be heard. That's not good. How about now? Okay. Because I had a huge fight with OBS uh, the last two days that almost caused me to stop streaming. But we finally got it. We finally got it fixed. And apparently in everything, it reset my... Uh, it reset my microphone. Mm. I don't want to go back to fucking slobs, dude. I just spent a lot of energy getting away from it recently. All right. So yeah, if you have a action points left, I'd attack the one you just made invulnerable. <laughs> oh, I do. I have like nine points left. Jeez. It's just a matter of what I want to do. What I want to hit him with. Let me try my regular. Oh, that didn't do shit. Right. Okay. Let's well... That did some better damage, just... Did not stun as intended. I know you are, bro. It's all good. And thanks. Awesome. Yeah. Okay. Dude, it got to the point that I had to let Hawkeye, like, remote into my computer while I was in the middle of work yesterday. Get that. Yeah, I know, right? Well, I mean, I was, I was still in the... the voice chat. Oh, yeah. That's being I just got hit in the back of the head with a towel. Oh, wait. Well, at least it was there. Because <laughs> I've, I've had some really bad towel snaps in my day. Oh, it wasn't a towel snap. I just got basically like a bundle of towel smacked against the back of my head. Great. Well, now that we mentioned the snap, we just gave ideas. <laughs> Alright, so I know where Wolgraf is standing. He was just close enough to hit the Death Knight behind the second Death Knight. Uh, so I'd say Bear Daughter, if we wanted to activate the spell on the guy in the back. Uh, would have to move 
a little bit in front of Kuthar. Possibly. I don't know full measurements just by full, like, looking at it, but yeah. Tr now try using the spell. Can you target? <sighs> yes, I can. All right. Like, just, like, the line was, like, literally, like, right at his heels. Perfect. And I don't know how many action points you have left with her, but... Two. Well, shit. <laughs> so I am going to just put Farseer on. All right. Because I can, I can try to ricochet next. Next turn. Unless they bundle close enough that I can pull off Reign of Arrows. But yeah, Ninja, part of the issue was there were a couple versions of OBS installed. And like the updates went one place and the plugins went another and yeah, you know my shorts are Your shorts. Like khaki shorts. Oh, khaki shorts? Or my cargo shorts, they're folded up in a pile. Uh, give me a second. Uh, give me a second. I will be right back. Okay. So, Ricochet might not be a good idea. Rain of Arrows, definitely. I mean, there. Main. Pull the game. Alright. Alright. Don't have much actions left with Kuthar. And my don't really want to use that, so let's see. Let's range on this. And how many of them can I hit with this? You know what? Just everybody's stats. Alright. Hmm. I forget. Are... Oh wait, never mind. I don't have the points for it anyway. Oh, we got him cursed and weakened, so that's a good thing. Yep. Cursed 
first in week. All right, Ninja. Hey, you're going to be up late tonight? Try it. That. Worth a shot. Oh, well, either way, I'll see you soon. I'm off tomorrow, so I'll be around. And try that. Okay. I'll catch up with you soon then. My guess is that they are probably close enough for Rain of Arrows. I believe so. I, however, am one point shy of using it. Okay. Fuck. Uh. I would get Bear Daughter out of there then. Because Bear Daughter has. Uh, I believe has the ability to ignore attacks of opportunity. Yep. And I'm saving with one point. I didn't have any um, the end of last turn, which means I should have the points now. Once the Spare Daughter's turn again for Reign of Arrows. Yep. And uh, hey, Hawkeye. I just got exploded. Oh, fuck. No. Oh. Holy fuck. Their initiative changed. Oh, god damn it. And there goes Wolgraf. Oh, boy. Well, here's the thing. If you use Resurrection on me, I come back with full health. Or Resurrection on Wolgraf, and he comes back with full health. That's right. We all took that perk. Yep. I have three Resurrect Scrolls. Cast skill on Kuthar. If you set me in a way to where I can do a line, like starting from one of them to go through the other ones, like... Wait, there's four of them? No. There's three. Ah. Uh. Oh, that, the, the one thing I was looking at was Wolgraf, okay. Um, looks like the best shot of that is going to be, like, right here. Perfect. And I don't know how what you got left for stuff. I, I have four points. Awesome. Okay. Mm. 
They might still be close enough to pull off Reign of Arrows. Worth a shot. Oh, absolutely. Spectacular. Well, if you want to... Res Woolgraph? No, uh, pick up the stuff. Uh, oh. I've got five res, res scrolls, so... Oh, perfect. Well, a possible new wand for you, a new helmet possibly for others and uh, amulet so I'm leaving the scrap stuff yep never learned the crafting feature so or at least that portion of the crafting feature oh wait thunderbolt grenade I gotta send that to Wolgraph and the nightmare grenade Wolgraph cool Okay, the helmet is a durable, thick leather helmet of vigilance. Um, it's 49 armor rating and plus one armor specialist. Uh... If you want to send the leather ar the helmet to Kuthar. Okay. All right, bro. Okay, and then the amulet is an aqua brittle gold amulet of the firebrand. Plus two to dex. Uh, 21% Water resistance plus one bartering. Oh, and reflect twenty percent of melee damage as fire damage. Me. Self water. <laughs> I'm gonna send it to Bear Daughter and compare. Okay. Which I just realized she has four resurrect scrolls on her. <laughs> yeah, the reason I, I had you send the uh, helmet to Kuthar is because armor specialist uh, increases the armor, my, my armor rating by three, which makes up for the difference between the helmet that I was wearing and the helmet that I'm now wearing. But it also uh, reduces the movement penalty for my heavy armor. Okay. And yeah, I'm not going to swap out the uh, amulet on her, because even though I'd be keeping the same dex bonus um, and pretty much the same water resistance, 
I don't barter, and I would lose my fire resistance. Right. So. All right. Do a quick save. Good call. Okay, that was good check. There's a charm arrow for Bear Daughter. Source tainted spider. Where's the trap, Woolgraph? You spot stuff, you gotta point it out to me, bud. Oh, I think it's already dead. All right, well, craft buddy. What is this key? Gate key. Wait, how did he get through that? Uh, he has a teleport. I can't teleport through there. Uh, well, like those? you gotta remember, his teleport is a rogue teleport, so. Uh. Right, uh, oiled steps. Okay, hello. Oh, fuck. Random fucking thing spawning in. Goddamn void demons. I mean, he's just one demon, so I'm pretty sure we got this. Yeah, so no fireball. Yes. Well, I mean. Wait, yes, fireball. Yeah, uh, you could use fireball. No, I was I was just thinking I don't want to harm any of us, but you know since he is on oil. Yeah, because that. Uh, the but okay. Forgot. Demon, immune to fire. Fuck. So, and now I can't see the target. Should we reload? No, we 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 got it. It's just because uh, it is Woolgraph's turn next. Oh, and hey, it removed most of the oil. There's that. this move and just because I don't want I don't want to have to worry about that disarming that trap There's still a bit of a smoke cloud, so I don't know if Bear Daughter can see him or not. Just make sure you don't hit that cr the crate next to the car. Okay. The reason I say that is because that crate is literally blocking a vent of oil. <laughs> Okay. Hey, buddy. All right, all right, I gotta. Let's see if just one gets me close enough. Okay. Nice hit. Yeah, that was my flurry, which does a bunch of attacks based off of my main weapon damage. And we're going to do this. Uh, 
All right. The oil came back. Uh, there is a trap somewhere. Oh, he's spotting the vents. Okay, good job, buddy. Good job. Okay, I'm standing on the plate. Wait a minute. Can we put the crate on... Uh, I tried that... The pressure plate. Earlier. Um, it is something that I wanted to try. Um, just as a tempty thingy, uh, sending, So before we continue, healing. <laughs> uh, buddy. Huh. I'm going to heal us first. Oh, okay. Just because that I realized I didn't heal you guys, like heal us before that fight with the uh, the demon. So. Oh, I know exactly where we are. Yep. It's part of the reason why I was like making sure to like, uh, because I know like your idea of using the crate to cover the button. You grabbed it from one of the oil vents that I was covering. Oh. I got it, but... Yeah, it's one of those things where it's like... I didn't want them to somehow chain link. Understandable. Alright, do I have... Nope, that's not what I meant to put... Step... What? Why the hell did it... Thank you. Because I wasn't sure how to do that. Hold on. That works. Well, no. I'm double checking something real quick. So, yeah, it's weight. The regular crates are five pounds. So they will not work. So. Did you throw the switch at all or no? I stepped on it. No, no, no. The There's a lever switch on the other side. Oh, no, I didn't even see it. Okay, I'm saving. Before I throw it. Okay. Did that do I think? Yes, it did. Okay. Good. Good. Huh. The switch got rid of the traps, so... I am now going to scan this next room for a switch. That's not attached to that fucking door. Different 
Okay, there's a switch there, but I don't know what that's for. Okay, maybe that's so probably on the wall, like the other one. Actually, with that update, I should probably save again. Because now those vents are gone, so. Good call. Okay. Oh, shit. Those things have a ridiculous range of sight, to say the least. Alright. Uh, gonna go to a... Let's see. Gonna look real quick. Let's... What direction are you in? Okay. Got our next location to try out. It's one of those things where it's like, for anybody who is watching my stream specifically, I am sorry for the jittery camera movement. <laughs> Woolgraph spotted a trap. Yeah, I didn't even see where you spotted that trap, so thanks a lot, buddy. <laughs> I see that trap that you spotted way earlier. Yep, same. All right, let's see if the gate key works on this. Nope. <laughs> All right, we'll graph, buddy. <laughs> oh, 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 I picked. Oh, do you see how close he is to that trap? Oh shit! Yeah. Oh, that. That could have ended badly. All right. Um, let's see. All right, we'll graph. Okay, so that solves the fire one. What the fuck? Huh. How'd you get in? The gate opened. Huh. Whatever Woolgraph did, the gate opened. Okay. So the switch that he hit uh, that he put the the barrel of water on must have done that. And the issue with this is that this is the area where the black smoke covers what we can see. There's a mirror up in the area next to the frost one. Which is why I'm like trying to figure out where for us to go specifically. 
Uh, Alright, I've got a place for us to try. I'm gonna check on the map. Alright. I'm gonna teleport to this gate if you want to teleport to me. Oh, puzzles. Um, do you want to talk to the deer that's not running away from us? Yep. Okay. It just thanked us for killing a demon. Cool. That was terrorizing the forest. It's probably the one that we freed the forest spirit from. Yeah. Probably. <laughs> and the only reason I say that is because he had a name. So I figured, you know. Named demon is probably the one that, you know. Well, he also said something about feeling her presence when we set her free. Disarm. Ah, uh, yes. That's right. This is the area where we were silenced. Wait, I forgot, who do I have that's immune to being silenced? You're immune to being muted. That's it. Yeah, and that's Vicar. <laughs> And Bear Daughter's immune to Frozen. Hmm. I mean, she doesn't have to worry about ever singing Let Him Go, or Let It, Let it Go. Hey, Claywell. How you doing, buddy? All right. Um, hey, buddy. Yeah. Uh, can you try and target that totem? With? Uh, if you can hit it with a spell without getting close enough to being silenced. Oh, wait, it's telling me silence failed. That's on Bear Daughter. I'm not seeing anything pop up with oh. you. Either way, uh, try taking down the totem. Because I think that might be what is causing the silence. Okay, hold on. Bear Daughter. Who cannot use Rain of Arrows. Fuck. Yeah, silence. She got silenced. So, yeah, sil so silence is muted. Oh, so then Vicar is immune. Yep. So if you just cast, like, an area effect spell on it, like fireball, let's <laughs> see if fireball works. Yeah, but I was going to say, given that he looks like he's on fire, I think he's going to be immune. It's more of a worth a shot because he's not going to be able. It doesn't. It can't attack us. So. Hmm. 
Because if we can end that thing's silence, I think the switch that's on the wall behind it uh, is what... Nope, still happening. Well, hold on. I'm immune to muting, nope. so... Fuck me! I, that's what I was talking about, was the... The pressure... The, fuck? the pressure plates that are right there. God damn it. That was some casual bullshit, Claywell. Okay, uh, how far is your, uh, teleport spell? I don't know. Um. Because <laughs> if you can put me right against the wall next to that, uh, switch... Where the like the fireflies are around. That part is too far. However, I can get you right there. Okay, apparently that was a bad idea. That's all pressure plates, bud. Well, then we can't get over there. Unless we can get through that gate on the other side. Oh, you gotta be fucking shitting me. Huh. Because Resurrect is centered on the person that's being resurrected, not on the person casting it. So, uh... With Wolgraf resurrecting me... Why is Wolgraf dead? Because he tried to follow you? I don't know. Alright. Hold on. I got him. I'm gonna... Okay. Uh, Alright, I will get him. Also, since the icon appeared... Uh... Repairing items. That was a perception potion. Okay, you do that. Um, real quick, I'm gonna I'm gonna loot all these crates. Razzle dazzle grenade can go to Wolgraph. <laughs> oh man. Bose. However, the walk it across the floor is going to be Poison fucking arrows. annoying. <laughs> Chain lightning scroll, that's so going to the car.
And Meteor Grenade, that's going to Wolgraf. Okay, pick up, pick up. And I'm going to loot the ones that are over here in this corner. Uh, I already did. There were not really uh, anything. So, all right. Doing a save. And we're going to go through the door that opened up. Which is over here. Oh, okay, buddy. Uh, uh, you're gonna switch to being a part the head spear of the fucking group because this is getting too ridiculous. Like Woolgraf spotted a trap. Yeah, that was right next to my foot, bud. You, you, you warn me better. I don't like this area. Something screams that this area has things that are going to. Where? Where? Where'd you... <laughs> you son of a fucking bitch. Where is this trap? <laughs> I don't see anything. Th that one I see. <laughs> you fucking asshole. <laughs> That's fine. We can avoid that one. I'm worried about traps that are in, like, the tall grass. Well, there's a chest. Um. What's well, in the chest? An earth wand and a toxic grenade. Okay. Grenade sent to Woolgraf. Eyeliner, my love! Ah. How are you? Okay. Who's our and, buddy? Yeah, Clay, well, I think we're good now. Do, do, do. I'm not sure if this is exactly what we're supposed to do, but... These statues can be moved. I'm moving them. T Buddy, you gotta warn me better. <laughs> Alright. I'm now looking for... Cross hmm. swords? Weapon statue of some sort? I ain't gonna lie, that thing's kinda stacked. Oh, the worshiper statue? Yeah. Definitely. I just was gonna think, I was like, damn, that thing got some titties on it. You know, because I kinda noticed boobs. Understandable. Okay. Yes, eyeliner, the Tiggle Bitties. But how are you doing? Also, I haven't talked to Matt. How's he healing up? Ah, okay, there you are. I mean, to be fair, who doesn't? Welcome back, Hawkeye. Hey, Hawkeye, could you give a shout out for Eyeliner? <laughs> I hope they don't have to be in like a particular order. Like if they have to be facing the circle. Clay, 
play well. Thank you so much for the resub, dude. 30 freaking months. Wow. And Hawking, can we get a shout out for Claywell too? Alright, I'm just gonna make sure that these are all like really on their pad. And then before I throw the switch, I'm going to save. Okay. Here I'll throw it. I feel like doing something. Okay, all right. we saved, so now I can All right, this is exactly what I was looking for. Yay! I don't trust... There, There's a rope between the two switches. First statue. Well, first, we cook that. And even not standing on it, it stays lit. I wonder if... Well, no, uh... I got a plan for that one, too. No, I wonder if we don't have to put something on the on the plate. Well, maybe, uh... Maybe not the final plate, actually. Now that I'm thinking about it. But, I'm just gonna make sure. Yeah. First state. Third state. Set. Uh... Right now, my only state is one of confusion. Alright, I'm uh, just going to go back through this mirror. And then we're... All right. Uh, I see one. Oh, okay. Now I know what the issue is. The leaf one. That's the one that was closest. The. Um... Yeah, I, I I remember where that one is. Yeah. That is the one that's the room that has all the oil vents. Yeah. That uh, Woolgraph had to sneak through. Yeah, and then I um. Got the I had to plate. sneak to get to the pressure plate to open the door. So. Let's do this. <laughs> like, we are getting there. It's just a... Uh... See, Claywell, I told you we were get working our way toward the end of the game. Alright. Before we start... Saving. Yep. And hold on, let me. Uh, I do have a plan though that does not uh, separate her. Invisibility. Shit. Good thing I didn't move. Hold on, I gotta wait for my invisibility to... Yep, you're good. Uh, but I'm gonna go as Wolgraph invisible, so... <sighs> Shit! Oh, well, burning failed, so... Alright, cool. I'm gonna send you something real quick. I sent Wait, it you. It says I have too much to carry. I sent you a water barrel. If you place it down next to you on the on the switch. Hold on. I want to see if the barrel has enough weight to activate the switch. All right, uh, use the teleporting pyramid to get back to Kuthar. Okay. All 
I'll use Kuthar's ability to heal real quick. Thank and you. And I'm going to go in as Wolgraf. At least the burning failed. Right. I still took other damage, though, but... Fifteen hundred more cookies, and you get to pick a game for me. I'm kind of scared. Only because I know the shit that I'm capable of. Because remember, Clay. Well, I made Skippy play Dream Daddy. Now I'll just have to make Kuthar play stream Dream Daddy. Are you buying it? <laughs> I mean, I did for Skippy. <laughs> hmm. But then again, that was just for, more for the meme of him buying it. No, I, w I wouldn't do that, because one, you don't have a... Um, a channel point redemption to pick your next game. No. No, I don't. <laughs> Yeah, after I made Skippy do Dream Daddy, he took that off his channel. Because he had to do that, and I love you, Colonel Sanders. Okay. okay. Um... But with that one, though, seriously? Why the hell did KFC ever make a dating sim? Okay. Trying to. F There's a problem with this. I somehow need to get to you. Oh no, I'm pretty sure that water or that, uh. The, the statue, the sentinel that's right in front of it, is what's causing the lava. Or, actually, no, there's a vent. So, hmm. Well, I feel a little bit dumb. All right, buddy, go quickly. All right, well, Griff, I need you to wait there. All right, uh, follow me. <laughs> We're going to be without Wolgraf for a, sp a split second because I was able to touch the switch with him. So uh, you have to link up Bear Daughter. Oh, yeah. Okay. I feel like we're making some, like, really good progress right now. Oh, yeah. No, the fact that we got through some of the stuff where it's like, I don't know why we're being hit with this, or why we can't get past this. I'm going to go check out the door real quick. Okay. Whoa, Graf, move closer. Alright, first things first. Sending both those to Wol or to Vicar. Sending you two teleportation scrolls. Okay. Oh wait a minute. I have armor I forgot to identify earlier. Frostbit and veteran scale armor of uh, air resistance. It's a 100 armor rating, plus 21% air resistance, 0.8 movement, 92 HP, and inflict frozen on contact. 
No, my armor is just slightly better. Very, okay. very slightly. <laughs> okay, I'm moving to the gate. And let me save because you remember what's on the other side of the door? Yeah, that big motherfucker. Ralzen Axaroth. Huh. Yep. A level 19 demon. Alright. Flow in the switch. <laughs> I have a slow, intimidating walk. Where did I go? Oh. You're still there. Oh, he marked me for death. Okay. What does Mark of Death do? Enemies prefer to attack you. Awesome. Okay. Alright, what do we got on this guy? Wait a minute, that void ram? I wonder if I can destroy summons. The one behind us? Yeah. I would try it, yep. Because tamed void rams are the ones that were there beforehand, so... Uh -huh. Yep, but he also exploded in fire. So, as a heads up, the things that are going to die are going to catch on fire. <laughs> yeah. Should I try to mute him? Uh, you, you could try. I don't know how well it's going to work. It failed. It failed, which means it's possible. Well, then in that case, maledictions. Curse failed, but he is weak. Okay. Haste. I figured I would go for his status effects. Let's go with winged feet, because I really don't want you getting fucking burned up while doing all this. Hmm. Claywell, are you saying that I should use Rain of Arrows? Because I'll make it rain. Yeah, that's not going to be that's going to be a good and a bad idea cuz if it kills off all these void rams, they're going to explode, but it'll kill off all the void rams. Well, remember, I can choose where to target it. I can exclude the void rams that are directly in front of us. True. Also, when it gets to Kuthar's turn, I can cast rain to stop fire. But if you can include hit the big guy... Um... What type of weapon does she have on? Bear daughter? Yeah, like what type of damage? Um, Heart Seeker, it's uh, 90 to 156 piercing, 27 to 46 water. Um, critical, 200% okay. damage, plus 1 dex, plus 1 perception. They heal from water. Motherfucker. Because I watched as, like, he healed but also took damage, so...
Well, I mean, if you can deal more damage, more uh, physical damage than water damage, it's fine. Which Rain of Arrows did, so. Like I said, I'm going to cast Rain, and then I'm going to probably focus on keeping myself alive, because I am now the main target of all the enemies. Because <laughs> of his fucking mark of de marked for death. Oh. Yeah, so I don't know what you got with Bear Daughter. <laughs> Unfortunately, the only other bow that I have Wait, the hunting bow It doesn't do the water damage, but I would lose the plus 1 to dexterity and perception and do a little bit less damage. It okay. does 188 or it does 88 to 152 piercing. Instead of 90 to 156. Okay. So it it's literally only a couple of points less. But I would lose one dex and one perception. Okay. Just for the just for the duration of combat, you think I should? Probably. Okay. Okay. okay, there. So, my first move. Let's get rid of this. Worth a fucking shot. Oh. Worth it. Take your fucking damage with you. Oh, he attacked Golgraf, damn it. Uh, well, I was able to shackles a pain him, so whenever I get hit, uh, he will take the damage as well. Ooh, I have one invulnerability stroll, but I think I should save that until we're at, like, the, like, final bad guy. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea. Especially because it's one of those things where it's like, we have the ability to fully resurrect everybody with full health, so... Oh, no, no, I'm not going to do hail attack. Nope, that's water damage. Here's what I was looking for, a meteor strike scroll. Well, they are still fire, though. I have another scroll that you picked up just not too long ago. Huh. Chain lightning. <gasps> yes. I should probably just aim it right at him instead of... Yeah, just to, it's like, because if it doesn't work, it hits him. If it chains off, good. <laughs> and it stunned a couple of the rams. However, though, because of my rain, uh, we're not really going to be able to move forward. But that's okay, because uh, Woolgraf has his hovery feet ability. Oh, shit. 
Uh, what did he 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 healed from your he didn't heal from water damage he healed from tenebrium Wait, yeah no 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 fuck my second wand is water no you dealt water damage so he healed from your tenebrium wand Uh. Oh shit! Resistances two hundred percent tenebrium and one hundred thirty percent fire. Slashing damage is his bigger weakness. Okay. Um. He's le he's least resistant to water and air. Okay. So, was Bear Daughter's bow slightly ten uh tenebrium? When you get a chance to check it again. <laughs> uh, so I'd say for you, uh, focus on spells that you can sling at him. Yeah. Worth a shot. All right. Okay, well, Graf, I'm very sorry that Wait, I... You may give him all your money to leave you. I mean, to be fair, we do have some money. Because thanks to my... crazy ass, we... I, I, I might have killed a valuable merchant a couple weeks ago. And we got to sell most of his shit. By the way, Claywell, um, from the conversation earlier during the podcast, I didn't realize that you were... Uh, Let's try this. I didn't realize you were a D&D &D guy. Okay, so... I should talk to you about the one shot that I'm kind of working on. I mean, of course, I would very much like, you know, Kuthar and you to be a part of it. And Remy, because Remy, Remy offered help. Okay, so Wolgraf does not have any healing on him, so I'm going to move him back. <laughs> uh, okay, I, Bear Daughter's turn. I would get Bear Daughter out of that fire. <laughs> I don't know if that fire is still there, because apparently she's not on fire, but... Oh, her bows, that's right. Yeah, double checking the one bow. It did water damage. So somehow they healed from... Weird. I'm gonna re-equip it if they're... Yeah, I would re-equip it. And then... Ricochet? Yep. Wait, shit, nope. Don't have enough action. Yeah, it's four AP to use Ricochet, and I have three because I had to because move I swap my bows. Move and swap. And move. All right. Save action points. Um, <laughs> yep. Go 
gonna use my once per turn heal spell. he has a haste spell that is the great one well, of the best things I could have done and now he's stunned he is slowed and stunned which means he's gonna have shitty AP but he also break broke free from uh, shackles of pain so That bastard. It is what it is. Hmm. I don't have enough points to take care of the ram. Okay. That last one. Oh shit, that one's still alive too. I wonder what's up I wonder if I can teleport him into the electrified water I wonder if teleport will work on him it should Okay, Ricochet. Yeah, so it's not water that's healing. I think they might be healing randomly. I don't know. I mean, that tenebrium resistance, I mean, the fact that it's 200%. Well, no, that, yeah, no. I'm just saying, like, the more from what happened before with the Reign of Arrows. Oh, yeah. There you go, little buddy. You do your stuff. Enter. <laughs> oh, no, fuck.
Oh, and it doesn't matter because the electrify... The electric shit went away. Yep. Uh, so, you could try teleporting... Can you drop things on people? I can't remember if that was a thing. I don't think I can. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Actually, you have... Damn it, he's too far. You have, have hail to no, you have hailstorm, right? I might. Because that, that was one that you were like, that's a massive area attack that does water damage. Uh, I have Winter Blast. Yeah, it was a scroll. But I can't use it. Oh! Sorry, I... Scroll. <laughs> what was it? Uh, Hail something? Hail Strike? Hold on, there's Lightning Storm... Uh, water Hail attack? Yes. <laughs> I was like, because that's the perfect attack to use on him because my ice elemental is not going to get fucked up by it. And I'm also going to move a little bit closer because, you know, what I'll be able to use my next turn. Death Punch. I forgot I have Death Punch. <laughs> <laughs> and arrow recovered it's like he's already frozen <laughs> it's like arrow recovered alright you probably got a shit ton of those oh the freezing arrows I have 15 <laughs> so yes you have a shit ton of those alright Kuthar's turn I'll use that on Bear Daughter. Drink my milk. And that was. I got two left. I'll drink this small potion. All right, buddy. <laughs> Death punch away. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. Hey, armsman. How are you doing today? Oh, yeah, I don't have enough action points to do that. Let me see what I do have points for. <laughs> Jack shit. That's what I've got the points for. All right. <laughs> well, yeah, apparently he doesn't have anything that costs only two points. Yeah, how you doing tonight, dude? What's been going on with you? Okay, so that would take seven AP. This takes four. And I will say though that that uh that that death punch did actually give a nice solid hit. Oh, Good yeah. kill. And a bunch of things for you to identify. As well as Enjoy. a as well as a large invisibility potion. Nice. I'm doing too bad modding a 24 hour. Ooh. Who's? Do, do I do I know them? Oh wait, shit, I forgot it was. Whoops. Shit, I forgot it was Um, yeah, so we have a raid target tonight. Okay. Mad Viking King, 24 hour birthday stream. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, that's without a doubt. Yeah, so War Raid is happy ass. Hey, good gamer. How you doing tonight, dude? Yeah, so how's the stream going so far? And uh, are you trying to stick with them the whole 24 hours? Are you going to, like, you know, break off, take a nap, you know, come back? I just tried a 24 hour for my birthday and, well, I didn't even make it 18 hours. Oh, shit. I need to sell. I need to sell shit. Yeah. Okay, a barbaric heroic sarong of the firebrand, which does plus two strength, 20% air resistance, and 18% tenebrium resistance, and then un unlocks the skill firefly. Send it to Kuthar. Done. I also have to sell stuff too, so I completely understand. <laughs> Yeah, right now I'm moving everything down. Hey, Carter. Currently sell it, selling decently due to the fertilizer shortage. What? Okay, huh? Oh, <laughs> selling shit. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Spiritual excellent, the Cronium Water Wand of the Tyrant. Yeah, Vicar will be able to use that. Um, slow down arrow that goes directly to Bear Daughter. Okay, Nimble Heroic Sarong of the Elder. Plus two Dex, plus two Intelligence. 
I mean, that's on whoever you want to. Hey, Kuth, or Carter. <laughs> I'll say hey, that. Carter. How you doing tonight, bro? Oh, shit. Uh, mm. Um, Armsman, yeah, I'll, ha I'll have time. Um, I'm off work tomorrow, so... Oh, I can definitely make the time. Dub, what is up, dude? I haven't seen you in so fucking long, dude. How how you, how are you? And thank you so much for the raid. <laughs> hey, Raptor. Welcome in, everybody. For anybody who doesn't know me, I'm Vengeful Jedi Force user and variety streamer. I do a lot of RPG, horror, MMO, uh, do some classic games, uh, a little bit of sports in the way of golf. Um, also love doing a bunch of co-op. Uh, right now, me and uh, Kuthar here, my my uh, main co-op partner in the the Jade of my Silent Bob. Uh, right now, we're playing through Divinity Original Sin, and I've been doing all right, dude. We definitely have to catch up because there's a lot of shit I can't get into everything on stream, but I'm doing good, though. Whoops. Hold on, let's identify this. Definitely sending that to Bear Daughter. Send that to Bear Daughter, and we're checking the sarong. <laughs> How's it going, guys? Good to see you. Oh, yeah. Okay, so she's going to lose a little bit of uh, water resistance and poison resistance. But she gains one dex and two intelligence. I think that's kind of worth it. I, yeah, I would say the one dex is probably worth it. Because she doesn't use elemental stuff does she like as um, in like spells nope the only real spell stuff that she has is um I think the the treating poison okay and hey pancake how you doing tonight welcome in DMs are always open for you, but DMs, yeah, I mean, but. <laughs> well. There's, you know. Discussions to be had. But, uh, yeah, Armsman, I will, um, well, obviously I'll be talking to MVK once we, uh, raid, but. Yeah, no, we can definitely make that happen. And. Yeah, Dub, it is really good to see you again, dude. Um, okay, back to Vakar, make sure I identified everything else. Yep. Okay, and you want to do a, uh, a shopping trip, basically? Yeah. Alright, so first places that we're going to, uh, we are going to the original town, and we're just going to search for merchants to sell stuff to. Try to sell yeah. some stuff, buy some stuff. Yes. Cause... Unfortunately, we're short a merchant because I might have got a little murderous. It happens. I mean, to be fair, I thought I was doing justice. Well, we I did... felt justified. To be fair, we also didn't kill just the merchant. Only because half the damn town started attacking us. Right, because they viewed the... Goblin is a part, basically a friend of their town, so. Which I still think was kind of shitty. Uh, I figured you were going into the center of town to sell stuff. Oh, I can. I'm just going, I'm going for one of the merchants that's farther away. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, let's talk to them. Okay. 
Oh wait, this bitch has no gold. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Okay, let's talk to you. Well, I sold myself, Otter, so now to get Kuthar to the next person that might have stuff worth buying. Uh, and remember, if you uh, if you see minor potions, buy them because I can turn combine them and turn them into bigger potions. Oh yeah. Okay, she doesn't have potions either, but she has arrows. Okay, uh... That's interesting. What's up? This uh, expert marksman skill book absorbed the elements. Um, decrease armor, but grant higher resistances against all the elements. Huh. Well, uh, double check what she like has skill wise. Mm hmm. To make sure she has room to learn that level of skill. Because if she doesn't, then... Yeah. Oh, here's one too. Uh, Survivor's Karma. Increased luck and critical chance of you and all around you. Oh wait, first aid. I am not exactly having any luck finding somebody with potions. Or resurrect schools, for that matter. But I am trying. Sending all these arrows to bear a daughter?
All right. Six novice, four adept, and two master. I should be fine on both of those. So I was able to learn first aid and... Oh, wait. Oh, that's the, the ring of arrows? What? Wait, did I not send it to... Oh, that's why. I sent her the wrong book. Ah. Because it was like, you've already mastered this skill. I'm like, I didn't, I didn't know that skill. It was Reign of Arrows. Ah. Uh. Fabric die not. Hmm. I think this was the guy with the scroll. Yeah. <laughs> they have Avatar Storms, Air Absorption, Firefly, Fire Absorption, Water Absorption. Yeah. And doesn't have potions. None of these guys have fucking potions. Hi, Raptor. Hey, Trout. There you are, bro. <laughs> oh, dude, by the way, because I, I noticed when I pulled up my uh, OBS today, thank you for the bits last stream. You did it literally the second I rated. But thank you for the bits, dude. And you guys, sorry, I got a little hyper focused on trying to find potions. Now I found some. And Raptor, I'm doing pretty good. How are you? And and you too, Trout. How you doing tonight, bro? All right. So you talked all the ones in town. Yeah. All right. So gather up. I'll teleport to <sighs> So fourteen you're trying to get out of the entry level town, Divinity Two? Hey dude, I'd pl I'd play it with you. I still have to play that one. <gasps> Ooh, you played your first Assassin's Creed game? Nice, which one? Let me guess, did you play Origin because you think it's like the first, like, maybe in the storyline? Origins, yep. Alright, head into town to talk to these people. 
Let's see if any of them have potions. <laughs> or the ingredients to make them, which I forget which. Well, you've got resurrect scrolls, but I don't. And I'm going to talk to the chick. Oh, she has two Resurrect Scrolls. Yeah, this guy's got three of them, so... Definitely take advantage of that. Other than that, there's not anything, I, not really anything I want to buy. Okay. Oh, damn it, that's a Master uh, Arrow Third spell. Nether swap. Make two characters switch places. Alright, I'm gonna buy this mushroom and see if this is the one I've been looking for. Stabs, da da da. Okay. Uh. Penny bun mushrooms. If they have penny bun mushrooms, I can use them to make health potions. Well, apparently Ramon's totally into me. Uh, he's a sex worker. That's kind of his thing. Let's see what's inside here. Nah, I don't want to steal shit. Trout, I'm sure you've got a lot more going for you. Uh, I sent a minor potion to Vicar. If you could send that back to me, I found the I found out that I had another. Okay. All right, sent. Okay. Do this. Now we're going to do this to see if this works. Uh, send me the uh, the medium potion that uh, that I sent to Bear Daughter. 
Okay. Okay, get out of there, severe daughter. Those are large, those are mediums. You said a medium potion? Yep. has a large potion and all the, all he has is beer Our selling trip. <laughs> uh, yeah, nobody seems to have potions. And Hunter's Edge, or for that fact, but like scrolls that are worth me picking up. <laughs> Wait, that was the Nazis? I thought it was the British. Who started putting milk and tea? Alright. That's not... Alright, uh... Thought that there were people in this village, but I was wrong. So if you want to, yep. Let's see. Uh, yep. Oh, I don't. What? Uh, Trout told me I cannot trust milk and tea. Fair enough. Like, so they're thinking, like, Oh, God, the incessant clickety clack. Yup. All right. <laughs> Saving. Okay, so. But my stream's about to go on ad break anyways. Uh, the question at this point is, do we want to go further into the game or do you want to save that for the next time we do a co-op? Which would be next, um, which would be Friday. Because I don't know exactly what we're about to encounter. You know, since we saved, I say we could try to go down there. And if we find that it's something bigger than we thought. Right. 
Okay. We, then we already have a save point. I'm going to save one more time. The classic gamer. Oh, Trout. You, Dude, it's all good as long as we get to hang out. All right. Oh, there's a... There's a waypoint shrine. Nice. Into the Source Temple. Slow down arrow, send that to Bear Daughter. Okay, so with that... Oops. Oh, Claywolf? What were you looking at? Literally did the voiceover for Mark Lickerberg's Jarvis. Yeah. That, sound, that <laughs> sounds fun, actually. There are crates down here. Ooh, there's a chest down here. Does not have anything worth. Damn it. Because <laughs> at this point, it's like if it's not worth identifying, I'm not grabbing it. Log update. So we will have no choice but to find another route through the temple. There must be a hidden path we haven't found yet. Hmm. Oh, first things first. Oh. Speed between each other. <laughs> hey, Claywell. No, we didn't quit. Jedi, apparently you just went offline. What? Oh, son of a bitch. I know what happened. What you got, buddy? When I knocked my vape over, it hit the fucking end stream button. Ah. God damn it. <laughs> Fuck it. I started again. Okay. <laughs> He's... I didn't mean to do that. That happens. You did. The thing is, you didn't even think about it. Well, no, because I've never had that happen before. Well, now you know that if things hit your stream deck. No, actually, it was key bindings on my um keyboard. Keyboard. I gotta clear those. All right, chest. Things to identify. Send in to you. <laughs> hmm. 
<laughs> so yeah, there's your answer, Claywell. Accidental hit of the end stream button. Okay, defensive veteran leather bracers of the handyman. 54 armor rating, plus one blacksmithing, and plus one craft. What the fuck was that noise? I was squeezing the rest of my juice out of a bottle. Okay. Ugh. That's okay. I was, I was very loud for what it was. So. Uh, what does Bear Daughter have as bracers? Um, I will have to check. I was not strangling a cat. I'm going to get me right. I'm not the greatest fan of them, but... Uh, her bracers are 31 armor rating, plus 1 dex, and 50 HP. Okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> What's up, buddy? Uh, send the uh, those veteran bracers that you just identified to Woolgraph, and then I'll send uh, Bear Daughter the bracers that I have on Woolgraph. Okay, sent. And then I'll send those to Bear Daughter. You'll lose HP, but you'll gain a uh, uh, reflection back on melee attacks to enemies. Okay, that works. Okay. All right. So So how you been, Decay? How what you been up to? I'll head this way. Cuz we didn't head this way before, so Hey, good gamer. Thank you so much for sh shooting out the Discord link there. Uh, that is the Discord that uh, I help run with uh, with Boss Man. Just such a great, fun community. Trying to find at this point anything that points us in the direction that we need to go. <laughs> Which I'm not having any luck. Oh, that's the mirror again. Hmm. Oh, that nope, that's the entrance. What'd you do? Uh, I dug up a spot and found an inert stone. Nice. I ain't finding shit. Well, yeah. It's one of those things where it's like trying to. I just did a whole run around as Woolgraph to see if I could find it, so. Alright. Uh. Rift travel. We are going to the end of time. Okay. Uh, well, that sucks you're fighting a headache, dude. 
Alright, let's go talk to the important people at the end of time and see what the fuck they have to say about... Well, anything at this point. not really that helpful so source temple entrance back to th oh I don't know oh wow there's a button on the rock. Alright, before we go further, saving. Good call. Because we're also about to enter the thing that's supposed to be the, the trial of the temple, so... Oh, those are just candles. Hello, door. Okay. What's up? Uh, we need to find more star stones before we can enter. I think we... I think I know where to find a couple. Star stones? Yeah. Where? I thought I saw a couple merchants have them, have them believe it or not. Uh, they would not. <laughs> they are story related. They might have had bloodstones, but bloodstones are not star stones. Hmm. I don't know. Well, with that. <laughs> Well, maybe we call it here then, and... Well, uh, probably like tomorrow can... and Monday I can look up s star stones. Yeah. Try to find out what, what, like, where we can find more. <laughs> yep. So. Oh, man. Right, save... Again, quit. All right, and then hey, everybody, switching over to this. And that's right, we are I forgot we already had a raid type uh, target. Yep. There the, he is. The Mad Viking King. It's his 24-hour birthday stream, so. It is. 
I'm going to go raid him. Uh, and then for me, I will catch everybody on Tuesday with group night uh, where we're playing Stardew Valley. Yep. And I will be back again tomorrow um, playing more Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. <laughs> Well, I've been I've been enjoying the game. I've heard it's really enjoyable, so it is. And I think after that, I think I'm. I object to your objection, Claywell. And after that, I'm thinking about restarting Stardew Valley. Not Stardew Valley. Octopath uh, Traveler. Uh, yes, that. Because you you talked about it before, so. Yeah. So all right. Um. Yeah. All right, you guys. Well, uh, I will see you guys tomorrow. We will all see you again on Tuesday. See you guys later. Peace. All right, right now. Yeah. I can't believe I fucking ended stream early. Uh, well. It's a...